Hello friends, welcome back to another video on the Firestore database series. In this video, we are going to learn how we can read and write the data using the POJO class object. We will use model class object to read and write the data. So first of all, we will add the class that is model class. So right click on this package, select new and Java class. So here we will simply call student and click OK. Now here we will create two variables so private first one is integer that is id and again private string name okay now we will create the constructor so right click here and select the generate you can press alt and insert button to select the constructor select both fields press ok now we need empty constructor so right click again generate and select constructor uncheck this field and press ok ok now we need getters and setters so right click again generate and select the getters and setters select both field and press ok ok now our model class is ready now go to main activity dot java and first of all we will write the data so in our btn save dot set on click listener we will add the data so there is no need of this hash map just remove them now here we will create the student class select student i will simply call it student equal to new student okay now here we will pass two values first one is id and the second one name okay now we will simply pass this class to our set method so pass this method to our set method that's it okay now we will read the data so in our btn read this method we will get the data so in this method document snapshot dot exist we will store the data into the student class so here we will create the student class object so remove this one and create the student student object and data document snapshot dot to object okay now here we will pass the class name so simply pass student dot class okay now our data is stored in this student object so we will get the data from this student object so first we will get the id so i will simply call it id student dot get id and for name create string student dot get name okay now test view dot id dot set text we have passed id and same for text view name so copy all this code and go to on start method where we have add snapshot listener so if document snapshot exists then we have to add this code okay now run the application now first read all the data okay now here we will add the id let's say i type any random id and name i will pass any random name okay now i click on the save button now here you can see our data is added as you can see here so in this way you can read and write the data using the pojo class object so if you have any question you can ask me in the comment section please like my video share my video and subscribe my channel thank you